So we've got a list. How do you access values in a list? It's pretty straightforward. So I'm going to create a list, some list, and I'll just go ahead and do this with a range function. And I'll say, uh, let's just put 10 items in there. If I print this, I'll just print some list, and we'll see 0 through 9. If I want to access this first value, this 0, I'm going to access it with index 0. So what I'm seeing, what we're seeing there is the value at index 0. Maybe to clear this up a little bit, let's do the range from 5 to 10. So this will give us 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. The, in, the first value is the 0th index. And I'm just going to repeat that. The first value in a list is the 0th index. So the second value is index 1, which is 6. And third value is 8. Fourth value is 9. So what do you think happens when I try to access the fifth value? If I try to access the fifth value, we get list index out of range. And if you're coming from another language besides Python, this error probably looks really familiar. If you try to access something that is outside the index range of a list, then you're going to get this kind of error. So let's also print the length of the list. And that's something that we can sort of count on, right? We can count on there being some length to a list. And if the list gets larger, the length is going to grow. If the list gets smaller, the length is going to shrink. And we can kind of say that a list is always going to be, uh, the last element in a list is always going to be accessible at length minus 1. So that gives us the last element of the list. We could do this uh, slightly differently. Python is very kind about this. We can access the last element of a list by just doing list sub. And I say sub as being this is sort of the, la the uh, index, right? Some list sub negative 1 will give us 9. So that's another way that we can access the last element of a list. And we could even go further and access the third element from the back. Turns out that's 7. So how far can we go? Fourth element is 6. Fifth element from the back is going to be our first element, 5. What happens if we try to look at the sixth element from the end? Again, we get this list index out of range. 